So, nandito tayo sa Gyeongbokgong Palace. Nakikita niyo yan, yun yung mga anak ng mga ng mga peasants. Peasants. Ah, Tony Modi, you may claim your prize now. I mean, you may claim my money now. Five times. Five times. Hi everyone, we are on our day 2 of our Korean series and we are invading Anguk Station! We will set our feet first to Bukchon Hanuk Village and Gyeongbokgong Palace. We will use the subway from Ujuru Samga to Anguk Station. Anguk Station is a total package Every exit leads to a different world. Thank you, Tony Molly, for a very large and effective visitation. Thank you, Madame is ready. From the station, we're looking for our way going to Gyeongbokgong Palace. We walk our way through and we're so thankful for JL for leading the way. She is our precious map. We looked for Hanbok, a Korean traditional dress. That way we can fit into the king's palace. You can actually find different shops offering handbook rental along the way. You can at the same time grab them from Click or just walk in. Angaling, there's a wide range variety where you can choose a dress for yourself and you can even fit them and check if it's good for you. The staffs are very kind. They help you style your hair, fix your dress, and make it look like a princess. They're awesome guys there. Lakad-lakad papuntang palasyo! Okay! So, nandito tayo sa Gyeongbokgong Palace. Nakikita nyo yan. Yun yung mga anak ng mga... ng mga... peasants. <laughs> Ah, uh, yun yung mga anak ng other other family. Kami yung totoong family. Nandito po si Inang Reyna. Inang Reyna, say hi! Ito po ang aking sister na karibal ko sa Toronto. <laughs> Oo, pero ngayon, ano kami? Ano kami ngayon? At least kami ngayon kasi, alam mo na, nagtitipid. <laughs> okay.
So this is Gyeongbok Kong Palace. So this is the main royal palace from the Joseon Dynasty. Joseon, Joseon. Basta Joseon Dynasty. And sabi sa Wikipedia, it's the largest of the five grand palaces built during Yong Dynasty na yun. So Kong Gyeong Kong Gyeongbok Kong Palace served as the king of... Ay, mali. Sabi niya, Gyeongbok Kong Palace served as the home of the kings of the Joseon Dynasty. In it. Korean novella moments. Madrama. Masyadong madrama. May the walk out! Hmm. I think nawawala naman kami. Nalapat kasi ng disyerto. I mean, ng palasyo. It was quite hot that day, yet we enjoyed the stroll going to the main royal palace. The architectural design is really awesome, and the culture really speaks for itself. Great view. And this, the 12 zodiac animal deities. Choose your weapon! Next stop, Bokchon Hanok Village. It is one of those places where the past meets the present. We are heading to the village where we can still see Hanok. It's a traditional Korean house. It's a very good architecture as well. And the area is actually elevated. It's quite a long way to go there, but the view is breathtaking. Pictures are really, really amazing. They even have this before I die statement. So, Think about what you wanted to do before you die. What's yours? Food time! Di ko lang alam kung what is this called, but you can find it from CEO Mart. It's really good. Don't forget to have bingsu! And doshirak, your Korean packed lunchbox. Yum yum! Along the street, you can find different items being sold such as shoes, hats, and many more. Did you ever know that Goblin, one of the famous Korean series, some of those scenes were just done around a corner? Oh look, you can never go wrong with click. They're everywhere. 
follow me for part two. Here we come. For more videos, please follow me and hit like and subscribe and turn on your notif button. See ya!